guys, welcome to another Transformers review. And today I have Hunt for the Decepticons Banzai Tron. Who as you can see is is a tank. <gasps> dun 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 and a cool one too. Uh if you've already watched some reviews of this this figure, you will know that it is a repaint of a figure. I can't remember the name of it, but I don't wanna talk about that. Yes, tank. Uh he's got three sixty rotation turret thingy here. Or another one here. Okay. Ah, uh, I would have liked it if they made the uh this part sort of the uh, on a pivot so you could uh move it up and down like that. Instead of it just aiming forward all the time. Uh, yeah. Okay. So it's not a lot to do in robot mode in vehicle mode. Uh on the bottom you can see pretty much the body of him and the little wheels. Just before I go into any more detail with this figure, I just wanna show you quickly the box of Voyager class. Available Optimus Prime Battle Blades. Ooh, hidden scarbod, scarret, scarab, scar, whatever that says. Mhm. Mm <laughs> uh, it says it again. There is in robot, in robot mode. Pretty big looking. I like the way they made him to a look like a samurai with a sword and things on his head. And there's some cool artwork on the side. Wow. And here it says Decepticon Bandletron uses his martial art scale to defeat his opponents. Whoever came up with that must have taken a long time. And there's a lot of writing to read. Right now for the figure. Okay, now I'm gonna transform it. So what you're gonna want to do is, um, okay. So what we're gonna do is just turn it to the side. Uh, oh no, wait. Okay, turn it to the side. Unclip the tracks or the caterpillars or whatever they're called, like that. And do it at the bottom as well. Ooh, there. Okay. And now. Okay. 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 Pop these out of their little, their little sockets just here. Okay. So once they're out of that, get any idea? Okay, there. Ah. Okay, so this is working. Ah, and then... Whoosh, flip them round. Lift this flap up. Um, put these things around to the tracks. Like that. And this is where the... Okay, and then do it on this other side. I'm sorry if I'm moving this way too much. <laughs> Very deadly. <laughs> like that. Done. Okay. And then you see these little shiny things? Just turn them to the side like that. 
turn the feet around like that. Okay, getting arm ache. Okay, then lift these flaps up on both sides and the fleet feet feet swivel out. And the little claws on the back to stabilise it better. Put them down. Alright, and there we have the legs. The do legs so we can stand. Okay. Next thing is now notice this bit here, so what we're gonna do is push it down. And there's his face. <gasps> Ooh. Okay, and then this bit here are going to be the hands, so just pop them out of place, bring them down to the sides. Ugh. Oh god. And then, turn them like that, swinging the arms forward, and then the hands are going to be folded in, so just do that. <laughs> and there he pretty much is. And these flaps here click into place on the shoulder. Like that. And then there he is. But still wait. Wait. What happens now? Oh my god. It's a sword, which you can put into his hand, like that. But wait, wait, there's more, there's more. See the back of this? It, okay, it opens to there, a bit more. And when you open it, there's a little spinny thing, the spin thing in here spins and this other sword pops out and then no dagger so you can either on the box it's in the instructions it said to have this bit open when he's in robot mode but I just think it's better if he's like that <coughs> and then another sword to equip him with and you are pretty much done with robot mode. So just do a size comparison. Um, this is they're basically both said head height, but because of this, it makes them a bit taller. Master Chief, he reaches up to the uh, elbow, and with Colossus, he's basically the same. So there you go. So the price for Voyager is twenty pounds. But I was lucky enough to get this for fifteen, and is it worth it? It's a good transformer. And there you go. So thanks for watching this review. Stay tuned for more Transformers reviews. Until next time. Bye.